Yeah. Oh, oh boy. Choo choo. Andrew Pinion and McCarry. Usually we did mega chain fast food salads, occasionally some smaller ones that were, but we're still in the fast casual uh, checkbox. Yeah. Today, it is unconventional. We're classing it up. Yeah. It is a national grocery chain, yeah. health food. We're Alcohol. classing it up. We're doing Whole Foods. Watch your pockets. Oh. Take care of your health. Owned by Amazon the last how many years? We did the salad bar at Whole Foods. Wow. Oh, you got a little spatial splatter I've on, got, upon opening. Holy smokes. I got that, everything in here. That is a what mega a, duty what salad. What a gargantuan task. I put all four salad dressings. Oh, look at that. Let's get a little, let's get a little shot here and there, shall we? Yeah. Oh, that's very. <laughs> Mine looks like a. Wow. A mat ah! It's a cur of sorts, but you gotta trust me. I got spring mix. I've got you knew what you were doing. Romaine. Yeah. I've got um, spinach. Oh my god! I threw in some olives. I think you got some grilled. cucumbers, yeah. asparagus, mozzarella cheese, artichoke hearts, uh, olives, Jeez, oh, pepperoncinis. Oh, uh, I forgot about the pepperoncini. Potato salad on the side. And grilled uh, squash. And grilled squash, cucumbers. Pinion doesn't play. Italian Thousand Island. Pinion ranch. doesn't play. Blue cheese, blue cheese crumbles, balsamic vinegar. I just found the feta. You found a whole lot of ingredients that I did not find. I have, I have all the greens. I have carrots. I have corn. I did get a side of potatoes. I got a dolma. Big fan of the dolma. I don't it know looks if that's, very. I don't know if this is. This Greek. looks beautiful, like it out of a book. Um, here's the the goat. The problem. The warning. Tell me the Whole Foods is not known for their cheap prices. A lot of the stuff we go is in cheap. Uh, what they're are we talking about they're that? already known as you know a little ritzy, pricey. But then if you go all you could eat style in their tall box, yeah, thirty dollars for salad. <coughs> right off the bat. It's my fault for being such a gargantuan athlete. Are you sure the scale wasn't broken on that? It, I went overboard, right? So it, it, they price you by weight. So that was my problem on the other hand i got i'm sorry if i'm doing 30 dollars for a salad i'm gonna go one out of four star for price point yeah that counts as a star for sure minus star is what i mean to say mm -hmm. um but already one first bite it's the most flavorful salad we've done so far easy uh, uh, almost as though i've done a disservice to our viewing audience because i didn't go nearly as crazy as you did and now i'm feeling kind of like i'm just eating greens and other things that but are not yours look very um too conventional. It looked aesthetically ple pleasing. Mm -hmm. Very good presentation. Yeah, no, I think I. Mine would definitely hold up in the health food scene, but I don't know if your viewers are going to be interested in this. I mean, I'm eating lettuce, spinach, romaine, carrots, corn. I I got a doma in here. You know what? Let me review the doma yeah. right now because this is kind of unique. Um. I just should say I eat a lot of domas. Any opportunity, anytime I see a doma yes. on a menu, I eat it. So I'm I'm very experienced. Mm. So it could be that I'm gonna be disappointed at all. Mm, hey. Not a bad doma. Yeah, okay. Whole foods, my goodness, who would have thought? <laughs> now we're both fans of Whole Foods burritos. Yes. And I, I are we, are, is what we're doing, is it going to resonate? We may be appealing to a different class, you will, people, mm. but than our usual customers, but nonetheless, they're they expensive. They are ubiquitous. They're so expensive. And they're really good quality, healthy, organic food. You know what? Your money, you're going to buy a car and get some groceries. There's a reason I don't eat here very often, but it's delicious. I do have it too. You're right. There's this flavor. I went really... Just traditional on the dressing. I just did olive oil and vinaigrette. Mm. And 
there's something about simplicity that is it resonates with me you know this is more often yeah i think so i haven't got to my potato salad yet um i'm still enjoying the greens mm -hmm. i haven't even thought about eating the hard-boiled egg yet i kind of the squash is wonderful is it really nice delightful um I like to leave my proteins for last. Mm. I usually eat the egg last. Mmm. Why is that? Um. Well, I have this philosophy, and I don't know if it's something I read or instinctual, but to bed my stomach with greens mm -hmm. and easy to digest stuff, and then put heavier stuff on top. Mmm. And I don't know if that has any meaning to it. But, it's what I do. I like it. It's been a while since we've done a review, huh? Yes. Yes. Now, what kind of dressing did you pick? I put, his ran I put ranch dressing, right. and then a little over on the other end, I put blue cheese, wow. and then a little farther down I put balsamic vinegar, wow. and then I put a few dots of Thousand Island. It was overindulgence for sure. Reckless. I've been bad this week. Yeah. Uh, a lot, you know. That is one of the most heroic slash reckless mm. salad ingredients I've ever heard in my life. I don't know if Heavenly Father is going to judge you harshly for that, if they, or reward you If greatly. Beowulf ate a salad, I... Imagine yeah. it looks like mm -hmm. this. Mm -hmm. uh, spring greens, some spinach. Beowulf indeed. Uh, people wearing Sriracha t-shirts. I hate mm. to alienate some of your audience. What are Sriracha t-shirts here? You know, the hot sauce. Mmm. Something really cliche about a grown man putting a Sriracha t-shirt on. Yeah. 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 I am going into a Whole Foods, you're like, what's happening here, guys? Like, we all know and love sriracha. You don't need to put it on your clothing. Of all of the condiments that don't need advertising, sriracha. sriracha. I guess so. Sriracha is good, but... Very good. It's kind of a... You don't want it on your t-shirt. No. I feel like that's trying way too hard. Mm-hmm. You know? kind of individual who wears a Sriracha t-shirt probably, you know, definitely twitches probably. They're the kind of guy that likes to advertise it. They don't, they don't endure their father's condiments. Yeah. Get out of town. Probably rides a fixed gear bicycle. We don't need that kind of buffoonery around here. No, this is classy. I want to see a guy in a French's mustard yeah. t-shirt. Or a Heinz ketchup. There is a gal nearby us right now. Me and you are having a conversation. Mm -hmm. If I didn't know better, I would say she's yelling at us, but she's just having a very impassioned conversation and tends to be looking our way. Very rich. Very rich. This is excellent. I'm not going to lie. Very good. Mm -hmm. But I feel weird about being 13 on Yes. How about you? I feel... I put... I presented a cacophony of flavors. A cacophony wow. of flavors. I, perhaps the potato salad I put on the side was a bit... A step in the... Overboard. Okay. But, um... And mixing all four salads... Uh, dressing was overboard. But the salad tastes rich and fresh, organic. Yep. And um, very flavorful. I think there's no question in my mind as far as the amount, which I put, and the flavor. 
it's really close actually but because of the amount and the flavor as far as a fast casual food chain I would say Togo's was our top and maybe of like a, one of national magnitude I would put Wendy's but throwing in this grocery just by itself I think this is probably the best salad we've had on the channel oh wow it's been this is a winner but, but I, I put everything in and in the kitchen sink it wasn't presentational it was probably the ugliest salad because I because of uh, it wasn't a coherent structure it wasn't a coherent structure because of my conquest desires but I would say what again price point $30 for salad it's ridiculous I, I put too much but there's no way this should be $30 yeah flavor taste I'm gonna go I'm gonna go four to four this is really good uh, this is probably the best salad but as far as the salad because we made it you know Whole Foods is a whole other animal we I've never done Whole Foods it's not really the thing we do on this channel but it's we classied it up yeah uh, we got a little healthy and organic and and uh, this is really good I feel like it, it's excellent taste it's definitely a meal unless you're shopping in a, in a, in a Ferrari it's a little pricey Too much unless you own a diamond mine yeah like I went conventional so that's why I just gave it a three but what you did you know when we were kids we did this thing called suicide where we put every soda inside mm. one cup when there were fountain drinks you did yeah. a suicide salad I did which that's, that's why it's so good yeah it's like every flavor is coming out yep salad coming off your hand you're so let me eat my hand up <laughs> so I think we agree one out of four price point yeah you're going three you're yeah because of price and then I'm gonna go four okay but you're going four out of four I think it's an excellent side but again it's cheating yeah I'm basically giving myself four to four stars yeah the produce the organicness all it's the good the quality you're gonna good get quality. that four to four I'm good I feel like the cat's got my tongue today for some reason I think I'm kind of in a food coma nice but it's a delight as always Great, great to be back. All aboard! All aboard!